Ah, Rave Comic says, yeah, the fact that, that the servers don't work and there's no other humans in your game is the troll protection. I guess so, look. Sea of Empty is what the game should be called. Sea of Empty, because there's nothing in it. The most empty game you've ever seen in your life. All right, raising the anchor. BM tells us, let's make the game as boring as possible. Troll protection. All right, here we go. Passing the island. Hook around it here. So where is the Kraken? Does anyone know? Is the Kraken out where the storm is? That's what I'm assuming. What do you mean I forgot a treasure? Resident Evil Beating says I forgot a treasure. What? There were two treasures. Oh, fucking shit. There were two treasures. I didn't know that. Son of a bitch, I gotta go back. Yeah, anyone know how you actually get to the Kraken? You hear that roaring? Is that the Kraken? So I completely circled the island, and I'm gonna just stop again. All right, so there, where is it? To the south of the island? It's to the south of the rocks. There's the rocks. It's apparently right next to a rock. Alright, here's the rocks right here. I'm on top of those southernmost rocks. Now I'm on the very southern tip of the island. So if I walk up, it should be directed to my right. Like, right here. I'm hitting! There you go. There we go. Alright, chest number two. Thank you, Resident Evil Beating, for, for noticing that there was another treasure on that island. That would have been pretty bad if I had to come back. <laughs> Now, I, now I'm done. So on this island, there's only one treasure. Alright. So I need to turn my boat completely. Question is, can I do this before we move out? I've already turned all the way to the, to the west. Do I have a full-on breeze? Yeah, I do. I'm probably going to hit this fucking thing. I almost guarantee it. I'm going to hit these rocks. Can't move. Look. All right, I gotta repair that. Yep. Repair that shit. All right, I gotta bail this water out. Now watch it amaze me as I bail the water out with only two bucket fulls, even though it's like 40 gallons, look, 40 billion, 400 gallons of water, I bail it out with three buckets. 
Amazing. The realism. Alright, done. That was really stupid. <clears throat> so someone said, said that I have a blunderbuss and a sniper rifle already. Where? Where's my armory? Okay, let's try the blunderbuss. Let's see how it works. Hopefully it's good. Alright, so where am I now? Okay. So, I need to go due west. Pop Chews, I'm looking forward to your in-depth analysis of the dynamics and subtleties of the game. Oh, yes. My review will be very in-depth, trust me. I'm gonna hit this island again. I am. Look, I'm hitting it again. What the hell? There. Okay now because now there's no, we're, not, we're at the water level where water won't come in there. Yeah. It's certainly a different experience doing this by yourself. It really is. It feels like a, a different game. Okay. WJR says there is no spawn point for the Kraken. The best tips are to go out in very deep water and keep an eye on the water. You see the beast's giant tentacles begin to encircle the boat and the water about the Kraken will be black and inky. Alright. This is a major pain in the ass. I'm just gonna go... I'm just gonna turn completely around. I'm gonna turn as far to the right as I can until I'm facing west. And that'll be Fool's Lagoon. You know what? No. I'll just go around the island. I'll go around it and then head southwest. There you go. Yeah, you do lose all your treasures if the ship sinks. You do. Some people are wondering. Yeah, that's how you lose your stuff. If the ship sinks, you're done. You lose everything that's on the boat. Start over. I think that's it dead ahead. Yeah, I think that's it dead ahead right now. That island right there.
The only actual penguin system, what do you actually do in this game? I'm getting a No Man's Sky vibe. Yeah, you basically sail to islands to collect je buried treasure. You fight skeletons to collect their, their severed skulls. Or you collect animals like chickens. And you trade all those items in to get quest ranking experience so that you get higher rankings with the guilds. Which allows you to, to earn money and spend money on customizations for your character. And that's it. That's the whole game. And then you can take over skeleton strongholds by fighting like gauntlets of skeletons to get even better loot. And that's it. That's the whole game. No Haseo, there was no third treasure because the treasure map vanished. At least there was no third treasure. Alright, here I am. So, see? So, it looks like three three dots, right? So, that's the first. So, it's saying it's the upper right. So, actually, it's right near where that skeleton is. Is where the treasure is. Yep. Right near the skeleton. Let's go blunder his bus. 